all right guys so in this video i'm teaching you how to do the reverse video effect so this reverse concept can be used for various things but i will be using it for this particular example whereby i'm getting ready to dress and i want you to see the reverse of me getting ready to create the content okay so let's dive into it once you open up your inshot app now mind you anything you do with the inshot app you can also do it on the cap cut app okay so you look for the same steps and procedures all right now you click on new once you get to the inshot app you open and tap the video once you click on the video you tap the new once you tap the new icon you pick in your video that is the recorded clip so i recorded myself dressing from beginning to the end so now i will import a particular clip and edit the, using this process all right so you open up and you select the video so i pick this particular video and i click the tick button so now it's already in the timeline of my in short app so i'm going to play it trim the part i don't want and cut it out you get what i mean yeah so this was me trying to create the concept remove my idea wear my cap wear my dress like a kind of dress with me concept okay so as i've told you when you are editing the first thing you watch your clip and you cut the places you don't want out of the clips so once you are done with that that's when you now that's when you now had your filter color gradings your captions your music your sounds but first of all remove the parts in that video you don't want okay so to do that all i do is just split the particular place i want and split the other part of the hand of the place i don't want then once i finish cutting the both side i'll tap on the middle of which will be like i don't want this particular area i'll play it check if there's no part i want in that video before i now finally delete it from the video if i finally delete it from the video okay so that's how to do it so once i do that i don't want this video to be long i'll move to the next step after you've cut and split the and delete the parts you don't want all right so yeah i have already cut split delete the part i don't want cut and split cut and split cut and split that's the part i was maybe wearing my drearies the part i was bending down the part i was not looking up all the unnecessary parts i don't want my viewers to see you have to cut split and delete them okay so once you are done with that now i don't want the clip to be lengthy as you can see the clip is over one minute 22 seconds right so i'll tap on the those that are very long and speed it up so i click on the speed and here i am trying to speed the process okay so you just tap on the particular video that is lengthy among them maybe the process of you where whatever you are wearing is taking time just speed it up all right so the video end up becoming low that is it's reduced in the size all right so as you can see i trimmed i will speed some to the point of like one point something minute and some i speed it up to two point something depending on how fast i want that particular area of where i want to speed to be fast so the end goal is that the video should reduce as you can see is now 49 seconds or 49 minutes right so your video should be either 30 minutes or one minute right so as you can see i have 49 so i'm in between so that's it for this and i saved the video so once the video is saved because now you've corrected all the process you can edit this particular video for something else but because i want to teach you reverse video how to do reverse concepts or be creative about being doing a reverse concept hence why after we save this video i could have just had my filters color grade the video caption and add music but because i want to show you the reverse video i know i'm not done with the editing yet so that's why i'm saving up before i now come back to do the reverse so if you ever save the clip and once the video has been saved or converted to 100 percent that is exported then you now import it back into the editing space like this it's now um converted to 100 percent so i'll click on create new to restart again so now i'll click on that particular video that just exported and bring it back into the timeline of the video edit so once you have it like this in the video edit 
if you play the video you see that there's no longer mistake it's only showing from the process i want people to see so i will swipe down to reverse once you click on the reverse it will tell you please do not lock the screen or switch to other apps so you wait you wait for it to code to 100 percent and once it's done it will be showing you like this you can see it wrote reverse success so that means it's done so now you can play the video and watch how it has reversed you can if you notice this particular video was the end result of the look but now it has reversed it to the front and from like this showing that i was removing my cap and afterwards it's taking it off so this is like if a fashion um video creator or a fashion someone that does something about fashion this is a concept you can also create and show your audience how to wear something and how to remove something do you understand so that's it so at the end of the day i end up speeding the old clip because i want the video to be shorter so now i have it at 24 seconds do you understand so like this now i will now add my filter by going to adjust to color grade the video so that it doesn't come out this way it becomes more clear beautiful and interesting to view by the audience you understand so all i do is to use my tint saturation my warmers and just go with the flow as how it suits my video do you understand like the process i don't have this particular number to choose mm -mm. Depending on where I shot my video will determine how I'll choose the effect I want. So now I saved the video and this is the end result. So for you, you can now add like a text, an audio, anything just to make the video attractive. And another concept like I also tell you about this is the storytelling concept. This feature, you can use it to tell a story, show your audience what you are doing and not really telling them about what you are doing, but telling them about something that happened, like stories that happened, things that you want to just share with your audience. Do you understand? This kind of content engage the viewers more. So I was trying to look for a caption to use for the title of the video as my cover video, but all of it is not making sense. I said, undress with me, get away with me. So for you, you decide the kind of text you want to use for your cover video. So I hope you find this interesting and I hope you'll be trying this concept too, but this is how to do a reverse tutorial. Also, you can try another method of the reverse tutorial by maybe when you have something you are showing your audience, but when you are editing it, it is showing backward. Like that particular thing is showing backward. I, I think I will try that video tutorial using the cap cuts for you guys. You can use the intro too, but so that you can see another concept you can do with the cap cut using that reverse. I'll try it out for you. So try everything incorporate them in your videos and see how your audience will be engaged to your page all right so i'm done with this i'm just going to save and that's it for the reverse video tutorial okay